It's a remarkably diverse crowd, no matter what way you view diversity. <laughs> um, I mean, I've heard lots of different languages. Um, you know, it's it's quite encouraging to see the Smazga board of different people who are here. And I've had some very enjoyable conversations about different viewpoints about things. Uh, I've been told I've been completely wrong about a number of things, and I've also been told I'm, I'm right about a number of things. So to have I suppose the degree of diversity that you have people challenging your views rather than everyone thinking the same thing is very important and it's great to see that so heavily represented at this event. So I'm very impressed by the diversity of the crowds here, I have to say. Um, it's great to see oh, an equal number of men and women. I, actually, it might actually be more women than men in this audience and when it comes to a tech event, that's not often what you see. Um, it was nice to see um, diversity of of um, industry as well, people with very interesting backgrounds. I've met people who are students, I've met people who are lawyers, I've met people who are, you know, ex-heads of large enterprise companies. Um, and you don't get that, you know, where, where you can get that kind of um, industry vertical diversity combined with gender diversity. Um, very, very, very interesting. Yeah, I think in any working group, you know, diversity is important. You have different aspects, different perspectives, different outlooks, different insights. And I think when you can get those group of people that have a common goal in hand, as well as common ambition, you know, then you have different ingredients. I always kind of relate uh, productivity and innovation to almost like being a chef. You have these different ingredients, you don't know exactly what the dish is going to taste like. But if you mix and match the right concepts, then you get something that's really tasty. The constant thing that you hear, in, especially in Silicon Valley, is um, that AI has a white guy problem, right? Because typically the people who are working on these projects are, um, you know, to be frank, white male engineers. And uh, you know, they've got, they've got great ideas, uh, but the problem is that when you have one type of person targeting a problem, then you're going to have um, you know, one type of problem that's being solved. And uh, so when you add different voices and different backgrounds to an industry like this, then you know, what, what else can you do but grow? And compared to my country, when I was studying uh, together with the software engineers, let's say 70% was male. We also have this problem, women in industry. I was surprised a lot of girls actually show interest. It is the best crowd I've been to so far, to be frank. I have been in to other machine learning conference or AI conference and I was shocked about the diversity. I had to check if it was the right place. <laughs> Today was good, I felt absolutely comfortable. Um, it is um, something that we do need to tackle and um, we need more women mentoring other women just to help them get into the field because a lot of them, they will be shy, they will be um, they would not be as comfortable to approach on this. So yes, more women is definitely needed. Um, and also people from every background is definitely needed.